YouTube as a media platform is constantly changing. Things that were relevant last year now are almost utterly useless. So I decided to give you top five pieces of advice from last year that mean almost nothing in 2023. So you will always be trendy. So let's dive right into it. Watch closely, hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, and let's begin. There is a common idea among novice creators that releasing videos regularly at the same time somehow makes them perform better. People think that this approach somehow makes viewers accustomed to your videos being released at a certain time of the day and makes them wait for them. And this is absolutely not true. The time and date of publication has next to no effect on the video's performance. YouTube basically says that itself. If you open Creator Studio, you'll see a graphic that shows when your audience is mostly active. We see that people are not watching videos in the morning, but are watching in the evening. Wow, what a helpful tip. <laughs> but actually, YouTube says Published time is not known to directly affect the long-term performance of a video. You see, it doesn't matter when you publish your videos. Of course, if you release a video at night, it most likely will not get up to speed as fast as any video uploaded daily. However, it will have no impact on views after a week. Algorithms will find your video and suggest it to people. You can test it yourself. Try and upload a video at three o'clock in the night. You'll see after a couple of days that the view count is identical to your other videos. In our team, we did upload videos at night multiple times. Either we were late on editing or other distractions, but eventually the results were typical, if not better. Now, YouTube Shorts. Some people still think that you have to create a separate channel for YouTube Shorts. Like somehow mixing Shorts with regular videos will make your audience less focused on your videos or derive them from main content. That's what YouTube experts used to say, and that's what people used to do, but no more. You don't need another channel for your shorts. Upload them to the main channel. Last year it was somewhat relevant advice, but now, as soon as YouTube separated shorts from regular videos, that advice became useless. With this one update, YouTube divided the audience in two. Those who want long videos and those who want shorts. YouTube Shorts is a separate world within a world of YouTube and it shouldn't stop you from uploading shorts on your main channel. Many content creators say to us, I will upload shorts, get a lot of subscribers, but views on long videos will remain low. And we'll talk about subscribers later, so stay tuned. But for now, I wanna say, why do you care? What if you are gonna have a million subscribers from shorts? Words, five to ten thousand views of long videos so what maybe someone will ask in the comments why but that's a good thing let them leave those comments let them be it's always better to build one channel one resource direct your energy on one channel with long videos and with shorts look here is one of our partners it's a purely entertainment channel here we started working together and the views on regular videos started going up they still do with shorts the graph looks roughly the same here, we started making shorts and boom, views are growing. And these shorts do not affect the performance of long videos in any way. Now, subscribers. Many creators are asking viewers to subscribe to the channel. I do it too, subscribe to the channel. But it's not really a necessity, like many think. It's in our genes, it's a thing we all do. Even if it has no effect or meaning, it's like a ritual for us content creators. What a video it will be if a creator doesn't ask for subscribing. Yeah, you get me. But what isn't a ritual and has real value is the statistics regarding your regular returning viewers. Many people think that the number of subs matters, but it doesn't. The number of subs is your social proof. It shows how long you have been doing this and that's all. In reality, regardless of your subscribers, there is a glass ceiling in terms of views that you just can't break. No matter how many subscribers you have, it's different for every channel, but each one has such a ceiling. The number number of subscribers may be growing and growing, but the number of views will most likely stay roughly the same when you reach that ceiling. Here, let me show you. Let's take a channel that should not be named. This is the statistics for the third video on the channel, 109,000 views after less than two weeks. And do you know how many subs there were when the video started rising? Three subscribers. Now it has over 500. It seems like we could even get to that thousand subs with one video. So there are views and no subs. 
How is that possible? The importance of subscribers is rapidly decreasing in recent years. More people are watching videos they found on the main page or in the recommendations and not from the subscriptions feed. Basically, you don't need subscribers anymore. To grow, you just need to create the right videos and we'll definitely talk about that later. Now, let's go to another already relevant thing, having expensive gear and professional editing. The beauty of YouTube today is that all you need is your phone and that's all. You don't need expensive expensive cameras, your phone will do just fine. You don't need to spend days and weeks learning professional programs, simple editing will do just fine. And for that simple editing, we really like to use Movavi Video Editor, which is a part of Movavi Unlimited package. Movavi Unlimited is all-in-one software that has everything you need to elevate your content to the next level. Whether you have large and unwieldy footage shot on your phone, Movavi has got you covered. It allows you to easily convert your footage into more manageable format and improve its quality up to eight times. With its user-friendly timeline, editing your videos has never been simpler. You can easily add, remove, or rearrange clips, adjust their duration, trim, or split them. Plus, with multiple tracks, layering elements like background music, sound effects, and voiceovers has never been easier. In addition, Movavi Unlimited offers a vast array of effects and video editing tools that empower you to create professional-looking videos that stand out on YouTube. You can add audio and text to your videos and create animations with keyframe animation. And that's not all. Movavi Unlimited also comes with a powerful photo editor that enables you to create stunning video thumbnails by cropping, resizing, applying filters, and adding text, stickers, and frames to images. With Movavi Unlimited, you can say goodbye to struggles and frustrations and say hello to effortless and impressive video editing. Now, get ready to have your mind blown, folks. Movavi's got a deal that's too good to pass up. An 80% discount on all the apps in an amazing Movavi Unlimited plan. That's right, you heard me, 80% off. So don't wait, hit the link and get yourself the ultimate video editing and production experience at a price you won't believe. Trust me, this is one offer you don't want to miss. Now, promoting your channel through search. Last year, we made a video where we said that search is a great place to start on YouTube. This year, it's already showing that search on YouTube is almost irrelevant. Remember that video from earlier that got over a hundred thousand views in a week? Do you know how much traffic came from a search? Zero. Here's another channel, business related. We thought that content will have a big portion of search traffic, but no, 1.8% only. Okay, how about educational content? Here we have a channel that teaches how to play guitar. Seems like a perfect candidate for the search. Wow. 7.6%. Search doesn't matter anymore. Recommendations do. Forget about SEO optimization. It's useless work on your videos. Even tags are useless. They can be useful only if something is misspelled, just to help the algorithms work their magic. But the impact of tags on real performance is close to zero. Work on CTR and retention period. I hope you enjoyed watching this video and it was useful to you. Leave a comment and subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching guys and see you in the next one.